Alright hey lads, welcome to the Sunderland Room Arena. Today we're looking at Diafra Sacco, the 26 year old West Ham striker who's been linked with Sunderland for a few weeks now. So what I kind of want to do is go over the reasons for him joining us and the probability of him joining us. Uh, so the first reason that he may join us is that um, he does know Big Sam. Uh, Big Sam is the, one of the people who signed him at, while he was at um, FCC on in the Swiss League. Um, where he was banging in goals for fun over there. He then came over to the BPL and has been doing all right with West Ham, been getting quite a few goals. Um, but now West Ham are looking to get rid of him so they can finance him for a better, bigger striker. Another reason I think that would be he'd be a good fit for Sunderland is that he's quite similar to Defoe in that um, he's not much, he, he won't do that much outside of the box, but in the box and around the box, he's absolutely lethal. Um, he's got a great header on him, which is something Defoe hasn't got and could be, maybe he could be brought on for Defoe in games where we are fighting a losing battle in terms of aerial presence. Uh, that about wraps up the reasons why he probably could come to Sunderland. Um, here are some reasons why he might not come to Sunderland. The first being that there's rumours amongst the West Ham fans that um, Big Sam and Diaphra don't really get on very well. Um, now, they, they, they may be willing to put the differences behind them, but I see that as being a massive stumbling block, especially for Sam. If he doesn't like a player, he won't bloody sign him. So, like, I'm not sure how that's going to go. Um, another thing is that... Um, I've heard rumours that the offers we are, we've made to West Ham for Sacco are absolutely nowhere near what has been portrayed in the media. Um, our first offer of 11 million um, was apparently only about 6 million. Um, and the West Ham Chiefs basically just laughed it off because they want at least 15 million for him. Another thing going, well, it could be going against him, is that we've not heard anything in a f like about a week now about uh, Diafra Sacco. Um, which I, normally means one of two things. It means that negotiations are going on in the background or that we've completely given up interest uh, because we're not willing to pay the fee. So I think overall I'd give the uh, move of Jeff Sacco to Sunderland a 6 out of 10 um, because if it could happen, but there's too many different rumours going around about him not, not like Sacco not being liked by Allardyce and... The fees will make it. apparently the fees we are suggest that are being suggested are just ridiculous. So I'd like him to come because I think he'd be a great addition to the squad. But right now I don't think it's going to happen really. But there is always the chance it may happen towards the end of the window. Hey right, lads, that's it from me. Um, I want to hear your thoughts in the comments below. So leave us a comment. Um, if you've got a different opinion, maybe you think he'll definitely not come or definitely will come. If this gets some good feedback, then I think I'm going to continue um, with this little series that I've uh, started and do some more videos on other players that we're linked with throughout the rest of the window. Um, if you want, uh, maybe you could comment below um, and say who you want me to talk about, uh, give my opinion on and rate the rumour. Um, but until next time, uh, see you later.